Hello human beings, my name is B. Creel and welcome back to your meditation practice. It's so wonderful to be here with you yet another Monday or whenever you happen to be doing this meditation. In our practice today, we are going to be talking about the little things, specifically the little things that add up to make a big difference in our lives. For starters, this meditation practice today might be a little thing that contributes to the rest of your day. As human beings, a lot of the time we're focused on the bigger picture or what's next. And it becomes this obsession almost of trying to control and plan out our future. Now we know from our experience in life thus far, there is not much we can control, but what we can work on is our reaction to what we cannot control. But even thinking smaller scale today, quite literally, I would love for you to use this practice as a way to contemplate the little things throughout your day. Maybe it's an everyday thing, every few day thing that really make a big difference in your life. And if we take the time to really notice how all the little things add up to make the biggest difference in our lives, it puts a lot less pressure on us to control the future. When you're ready, you'll take a moment to find your seat. If you're sitting on a cushion like me, your legs can be tucked behind you or loosely crossed in front of you, just giving your low back a little bit of extra support today. And sitting up tall, this feeling of being upright but not uptight. <laughs> Shoulders soften down away from the ears. And just taking a moment here to locate your gaze, either eyes open or eyes closed. If your eyes stay open, gaze will be cast down on the floor, just a few feet in front of you. As you gaze down toward the floor, blinking happens automatically. It's almost as if you're looking through the floor in front of you. And then start to locate your breath. That gentle sensation of air moving through the body. We use this first moment of practice as a way to check in. And maybe checking in is the first little mark of self-care that adds up to make a big difference in our day. Simply by checking in, we're putting a bit of importance on care for ourselves knowing that we actually wonder and care about how we feel. And as you continue to follow the breath with your mind, really noting that the breath is so simple, it's always there, it's always happening. Yet the breath really does add up to keep us alive throughout the day. So keeping things simple today, when you notice that your mind has left the breath, using the following moments to point out what distracts you, let it go, return back to the feeling of the breath in the body, and start over.
again. If you notice here that your mind has wandered off, no big deal. Be really gentle with yourself as you return back to the breath. Use this moment in time to return. final moments of practice today. I encourage you to dig deep or maybe you don't even have to and think about one small thing that you are grateful for today. It could be a feeling, it could be the fact that you showed up today Maybe you have an animal next to you, keeping you warm. But whatever it is, let that sink in. Maybe it even sparks a little bit of joy. And then when you are ready to transition out of your practice, you can open your eyes, raise your gaze and start to come back into the room. Amazing job. I hope that you all have a wonderful rest of your day. Thank you so much for your practice and Gus and I look forward to seeing you next week.